Hey guys, Matthew Sandy 90 here. Today is Friday, March the 25th. And right now, I'm actually walking in the Blackbridge Forest right now. I'm actually near the boat. Um, so I decided to just walk down the forest for you guys. And uh, yeah, I also wanted to vlog because I haven't been here in a little bit. Yeah, like I haven't walked down here for a little while. I think it's been like about a month almost. So yeah. But I hope you guys are having a good day today. Let me know in the comment section down below how your day is going. Uh, I'm having a good day. Yeah, my day's going good so far. Yeah, I'm having a good day. So yeah, guys, look at this. Hey, look at the scenery. Yeah, it is a little cloudy today, but also, uh, but also there's a bit of sunny sky or clear sky over there. So it's not too cloudy. Yeah. And right now we're by the old uh, train piece right now. Yeah. There's like the sunset. And then there's, uh, you know, the bushes. If I got, I don't know if I guys told you this, but last year, uh, me, Dustin, and another one of our friends, uh, we walked down like down there, and I had, a, and I got a tick, right on my leg, like right where I'm pointing. So yeah, wasn't really that good. Dustin had one on the back of his ear. Thank God it didn't bite us, right? <laughs> Thank God. See so, ya. Yeah. Oh yeah, guys, check it out. I got new shoes. Hey. Uh, I gotta see if I can try and get over there, guys, because, look, it's, you know, muddy. So I might try and, uh, walk over to the boat. Wait, because I want to see if I can go to the boat for you guys. See ya. If no one's on the boat, I'll try and see if I can get on and show you guys, like, see what's been, see what's new with the boat. See if people have been writing new stuff or still the same from last time. Because I don't know if I walk. I don't know if I've been on the boat last time. I haven't been on the boat in a while, so... Yeah, hopefully nothing's really changed. Hopefully me and Dustin's names are still there. Hopefully, right? Hopefully no one covered them up. Because that would be really well. <laughs> so, yeah, hopefully not. Okay, I gotta get around this. So I gotta get onto the side here. Just hop over some mud. Oh, this is... <clears throat> I had to hop over. There we go. Yeah, just gotta go around the mud. Don't step in the mud or the puddle, because, you know, that would get my shoes muddy and probably socks wet if it's deeper. Oh, there we go. Okay, is anyone on the boat? I'm just, sorry guys, I'm just making sure no one's on the boat. But it doesn't look like it. It doesn't look like it, so... Yeah, it doesn't look like it, so I think we're good. Yeah, I think we're good. I don't think anyone's on it. I don't, I don't see anybody, so... I think we're good, guys. Now, if it's not slippery, I'm going to try and climb on there for you guys. I'm going to try and climb up for you guys if it's not too slippery. Hopefully, the mud doesn't make it slippery. <laughs> yeah. But I'm trying not to step in too much mud, you guys. So, yeah. But, yeah, I hope you guys are having a good day. It's Friday, so it's almost the weekend. Yeah. Now, guys, I went to Goodwill today, and I actually got a new album. I got a... Avenged Sevenfold album. Hey, it's pretty nice. Yeah. Oh god, look at this. It's a lot of mud there, guys. I gotta try and to. Okay, yeah. Man, my shoes are getting kind of muddy. Oh god. Sorry, guys. Just trying to walk around the mud, but it's like I can't get out of it because there's mud everywhere. All right, just trying to walk over the. I'm just trying to walk on the non-muddy spots, or the mud, or the spots that don't have as much mud. That's kind of hard, especially this part right here. Oh god! All right, go around the rope. All right, guys, we're at the boat. We made it. Uh, yeah. Now my shoes are a little bit muddy. Yeah. Uh, I might try and get on the boat. I'll try. Hopefully, I don't slip. Hopefully, I don't slip, you guys. I'll try and, I gotta try and do this one-hander. And if I fall, then, uh, yeah, that won't be good. Okay. Sorry, guys. I just gotta try and do this one-hander. Oh. The sleeve on my light jacket isn't as, uh, big as my sweaters. So... Sorry guys. So it's kind of rolling up my sleeve, which is not good. Sorry guys. 
Okay, we're almost there. We're getting there, guys. I'm trying to hold on as much as I can. Getting my hands dirty here. Touching a rusty boat. Oh, God. Yeah, guys, I haven't been up here in a while. Oh, I'm kind of shaking a little bit. Like, I'm a little nervous, a little scared to be up here. Because I haven't been up here in so long. Oh, God. All right, guys, we're here. We're up on the boat. We made it. Step down. There we go. Okay. Now let's make sure this isn't slippery. No, it's not. Okay. Whew. All right, guys, we're here. We're on the we're at the boat. We're on the boat. We're inside. Oh yeah. Hey, our stuff's, our names are still here. Nice, our stuff is still here. Yeah. Very nice, very nice. Oh, yeah. Yeah, look at this, guys. <laughs> yeah, it's like all the stuff that's in here. Oh, yeah. Man's are kind of dirty now because, you know, touching the boat. So, yeah. Huh. All right. Yeah, guys, of course, still some garbage down there, and there's the old motor for the boat. Yeah. Now, I don't know if I guys told you this, you know, I don't know if I guys told you this, but uh, a long time ago, well, it wasn't a long time ago, it was actually two years ago. This was back in 2020. Um, this was during the fall time of 2020. I think I told you guys, I think last year I told you guys about the story of when me, Dustin, and Rose were um, hanging out here on the boat, and... Um, we were, you know, smoking weed and <laughs> yeah, all that. Dustin didn't do anything because he doesn't smoke weed. Yeah. I don't as much anymore, so, yeah. I do sometimes, like once in a while, but not all the time anymore, so, yeah. But, yeah, so I, yeah, I, I was sitting right here. Actually, yeah. Basically, where I'm standing is where I was sitting. Rose was sitting, like, right here by the door here. And Dustin was, like, standing right over here, so... Yeah, that's and it was actually stormy that day too, so yeah. Ooh, guys, look at this. The sun is now kind of out. Nice. You can hear the birds chirping, so it's very nice. Yeah. And I think I did a tour of the boat here uh, back in 2020 for you guys. I think I did. Yeah. Um, you guys want? If you actually, I think it's up. I, actually, I think it's on this channel still. If, so, oh, sorry guys. If you guys want to check out that video, I'll put the link in the description down below. So. Um, yeah. Um, actually, guys, I want to take some pictures here. I'm going to put the camera back up when I'm off the boat. So uh, I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, guys. So we just got off the boat now. Um, I'm just walking down the trail right now. See, so look. Yeah, I'm just walking down the trail. Um, I took some nice pictures, so I'm going to be posting them on my Instagram later. If you guys want to check them out, uh, go f follow my Instagram. Link will be in the description down below. So, yeah. So we're just walking down the trail, and yeah, now you guys, um, still really muddy there. Yeah, there wasn't really a lot on the boat, you know, nothing's really changed. It's just, there's like a few new graffiti, but, you know, nothing's really changed. It's not really a lot, so it's still the same, really, from last time I was on it. Still the same. Do you guys hear that? I don't know if it's coming from the trees or what, but it's kind of a weird noise. Yeah. So, hey guys, um, we're just walking out of the, or we're just walking now. So, yeah, hope you guys, so yeah, how are you guys doing today? Uh, I, I know it's, I know I asked you guys that already, but, um, how are you guys doing? Hope, what are you guys' plans uh, for this weekend? Let me know in the comments below what your plans are for this weekend. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to do this weekend. Yeah, it's probably just going to be whatever, right? <laughs> yeah. 
No, actually, guys, while I'm here, I want to show you guys uh, where the guy chased me and Dustin at the Black Ridge Forest last summer. I know I might have already um, made a video about that with him, but I want to do it. I want to show you guys, in case you guys haven't heard or haven't haven't watched that video, I'm going to show you guys where he chased us, if I can remember where exactly we were standing. But it's along this trail somewhere, so, yeah. Now, if you guys actually remember, I actually walked down here in a vlog in February, so, yeah, ew. Look at those turds. Oh, dog turds. Oh, yeah, speaking of a dog, there was a dog, like, around this area, and he didn't have a leash, but the owner was with him. But the dog, like, kept trying to, like, come at, like, come, like, towards me, and I was like, please back up. I was like, nope, back up, back up, boy, back up. And I was like, bro, like, do you not have a leash for that dog? Like, bro. Like, I was afraid, like, the dog was, like, gonna try and, like, chase me or something. I was like, you're about to run. <laughs> well, yeah. Yeah, of course, the first thing I witness when I'm around here is a dog feeling like it was about to chase me. Like, ugh. Why? It's like, why? <laughs> you know? Yeah. But anyway, so, we're, I think we're getting close now to where we were, and I'll show you guys where we were standing. It's, it's a little further down there, though. It's not, like, right here. Yeah, it wasn't around, yeah, 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 no, it wasn't here. Oh, wait, I think it was, like, about here or something. Uh, alright. Okay. Okay, yeah, this is it, right here. I remember it now, okay. So, this was, okay, so this took place at the end of July last year, the last day of July. Me and Dustin were hanging out, you know, we were walking from that way, we were going to the boat, that way, and, well, and I think, and yeah, we, yeah, we were walking this way, once we got to about here, like by this tree here, we saw the guy come around the corner here, and if you guys don't know what he looked like, he was like kind of sketchy, like he had like a, like a, like a long sleeve shirt, and like his pants were like kind of like a little down. Not like all the way down, but like a little bit like bagged almost. And he had short hair, and one of his eyes was like kind of red, like this one was like kind of red. And he was like talking like, <laughs> like literally, like it was like literally like that. And he was like walking around, and I think he had like something in his hand or something. And immediately, you know, immediately me and Dustin got sketched out. We were like, uh, okay, like what is this guy going to do? Because like, at first I thought he was going to let us through. So we can continue that way to go to the boat. But no, he wouldn't let us go through. He actually purposely was blocking us. And I don't know what, I don't know what it was, but apparently he, maybe he thought like we were trying to start something. But like we were standing here and we were like, me and Dustin were like questioning like, okay, like what should we do? Like, should we just keep going? Should we go around him? Or should we just go away, back up? And he kind of started walking towards us a little bit. And we were like, okay, please back up, back up, please. Like, can we please just, Go, can we please just go around and go to the boat? But we didn't want to take a step forward because I thought like he was going to like attack us or something, right? Because I I had a, I had the feeling like he was going to attack us if we try to like go close to him or go around us. He would like try to like punch us or beat him up, beat us up or something or or like assault us, right? Or do something, right? Like me and Dustin were like so scary. Like we didn't like we were getting so scary. Like we didn't know if we wanted to back up or go around. So, but he once he started walking. If, he, like, so once he started taking a few steps towards us, we, like, kind of backed up, like, okay, back up, please, like, you're getting too close, and then he was, like, Ugh. like, he started, like, getting aggressive a little bit, and I don't know what his, like, I don't know what this guy was on, like, I feel like he was either on, like, meth or something like that, but, like, now, if this gets age restricted for me saying that, then I apologize, you guys, but no, like, he was on some sort of drug, and he definitely was on drugs, and... He started walking towards us a little bit more, and we were like, okay, like, what should we do? And then all of a sudden, like, we just started, like, back, like, walking a little bit. Like, we, me and Dustin started turning, we turned around, and we started walking back, because we were like, okay, you know what, this guy's clearly going to try and do something if we walk towards him or go around him, or stand here for too long, so we decided to leave. But then eventually, but, but then the guy started following us. He started walking with us, like, following us. Like, I was, like, I was right here, Dustin was behind me, and the guy was behind Dustin. And then we started, like, eventually we noticed it, and we started speed walking. Like, we started walking faster, and then he started speed walking. And then we were, like, running like this. Like, we were running so fast. And I'm not going to run all the way, guys. But, 
You know what I mean? Like I started running and then Dustin started running, but then the guy started running. He started running, like following us all the way like near the black bridge. And then like we like we were running guys, like we were sprinting, we were booking it, we were hauling ass back to the black bridge. And because we had so much adrenaline and like we were so scared, you know, creeped out and like sketched out, had a lot of adrenaline after that that we just fight or flighted fucking lift. Like, it was like, fight or flight, get out of there. Like, we gotta go, because this guy's clearly gonna try and do something if we stay there too long. Now, I guess maybe it was just poor timing, or, you know, we just picked the wrong time to go to the Black Bridge Forest. We kind of picked the worst time, because that guy was there. So, yeah, like, wow. It was really sketchy. And then once we got to the Black Bridge... Like, eventually he started walking again. So, like, he eventually, I think maybe he, like, ran out of breath or energy to keep running. But we had more, but me and Dustin, like, we had more energy than him. That's why we were still running for a bit. Because we, like, we just wanted to get out of there as fast as we can. And then the guy, we saw the guy start walking again. And then we kind of started walking again. Because we thought, like, okay, maybe it's okay to start walking again. Because maybe this guy's not going to... But in my head, I thought for a second that is if this guy's gonna try and chase us or start running again, we gotta start booking it again. I was so afraid he was gonna do that, but the guy wasn't running. He was still walking, he didn't run again, so thank God he didn't run again. Thank God he was only walking this time, because otherwise that would have been I mean that would have meant we would have to run. Like run. Run all the way to the Black Bridge and then like across the river and onto the busy road, right? Grand Ave. Back to main roads. So that's what I thought we had to do, but no. That that's not what we had to do at all. Like it was basically just we had to fucking fight or flight run out of there. Now, I hope that we never see that guy again, because if we saw that guy again, imagine what would have happened. Well, the same thing probably would have happened. I would have had to run away from him, but I would just be by myself. Would he recognize me, though? He probably would. Like, he probably would recognize me. Or maybe he'd be too fucking high to even notice me. But if he were to notice me and recognize me, he would probably run after me. I, yeah, that would be bad. Now, guys, I'm honestly surprised we weren't vlogging. Because, well, actually, no. We made a TikTok video of us throwing a rock over the bridge that day. And then we walked to the Black Bridge after. Honestly, guys, I wish we filmed it. I wish we filmed it for you guys, just so you guys could see what happened. We, I wish you, I wish, I, w I wish we filmed it for you guys because it would have made a crazy video. It would have made a crazy vlog, and it was, it wouldn't have been a good vlog. It would have definitely been a crazy vlog. So, yeah, we're just by the truck trailers right now, you guys. So, yeah, but yeah, guys, that was crazy when that guy chased us. Last summer was it definitely fucking scary. Oh wow. Like it was definitely scary. Definitely creepy and sketchy, really. So yeah. Now thankfully we never had something like that happen since then. And I hope nothing happens again like that. Because that would be bad. So at that time, it wasn't really a good day at that time because of that, but I mean, other than that, it wasn't okay. It was a pretty good day for the rest of that day, but during that moment, it wasn't really great because, you know, we had to deal with that. We had to experience what happened, right? Anyway, so, uh, yeah. Um, we're almost near the tracks, you guys. I might, I'm going to keep vlogging for you guys. I think I might keep vlogging. I need to find a way out of here. Over there, here. Did you just hear that? I think it was a squirrel or something. Could have been squirrels. <laughs> yeah, I almost got. Yeah, I almost got like me. My heart like kind of go like a little bit because I was like, oh shit, someone here. But no, I think it was a squirrel. So yeah. Okay, I think we. Yeah, there we go. There's the exit. Found an exit, guys. Just gotta go around these. Book trees here. This is a way you can get out of here. I'm back on the trail on the tracks there. Yeah. <laughs> you just hear that, like, wow. Damn. <laughs> well, okay. Alright, cross. 
Oops, on the tracks. Oh. Yeah, that. Okay, someone's coming. Uh, I might go this way, just go around him. Because, I don't know if you guys can see, but there's someone coming across the bridge. So yeah, guys, um, we're going to keep walking. I just want to make sure this guy doesn't get close. But, because uh, I don't know who that is, and if, so if someone's sketchy, i got to get out of the way. Because <laughs> I do not want something to happen. Not after I just told a fucking story about what happened last year, right? I don't want to do that, because that would just be, wow. <laughs> really? Something would have happened? Just me after fucking saying a story? Yeah, this guy's hauling ass. Yeah, someone's hauling ass, so I got to get GTFO out of the way. I'm going to keep walking, though, just so I'm just walking. Hopefully, he's not going to turn when I turn. Okay. We're going to go this way. Okay. Well, I don't even know if going down here is better, but we're definitely just gonna walk. Make sure no one. Okay. Sorry, guys. I'm just trying to make sure the guy, because there's a guy riding his bike down there. I want to make sure he's like not anyone who's gonna try and do something. Just, just want to be sure. <laughs> yeah, because yeah, I don't. Yeah, because if something were to happen, I would get on camera, get on videos, and I would definitely still post it for evidence. It's like, but it's like, dude, you want to try something? I'm, I'm vlogging, I'm filming right, I'm filming you right now. <laughs> so yeah, that's a retirement home, you guys. Yeah. Oh yeah, I don't know if I guys uh, told you this, but um, I actually heard that they're might, they probably, they're probably looking to turn. Okay, I'm sorry. Um, I don't know if I guys told you this, but did you guys hear that um, they're possibly looking to uh turn the old because you know that old school on murray street by the train yard well i heard they're um they're looking to maybe see if they can turn it into like a homeless shelter now honestly guys a homeless shelter at the old school wouldn't be a bad idea because uh you know it's close to the black bridge forest and they pretty much hang out there a lot all the time right like we see a lot of like sketchy people and like home well homeless people when we say homeless people we see a lot of them like in this area a lot and so and plus you know they need to do something with the old school on murray street anyway so i think a homeless shelter work i think a homeless shelter would be a good idea for to put one there yeah and so uh yeah i think that would be a good idea okay yeah that guy just turned down the street okay <laughs> we're gonna go left Yeah, filming, so that's good. It's like, bro, you want to do something? I got you on fucking film. It's like, you want to do something? I got something. I got you on video. <laughs> it's like, bro, I'm vlogging right now. You want to do something? You'll be on video. So, yeah. It's like, I'm filming for my protection, okay? <laughs> so don't even think about doing something. So, yeah. Uh, yeah. I might actually go over to the school and uh, show you guys. In case if I haven't vlogged the school before, but maybe I have before. Wait, have I? I actually don't know. <laughs> it's like, of course, we're gonna go this way. Like, of course you're gonna go this way. <sighs> anyway, that was the guy I was talking about. I don't think you guys saw him, but that was the guy I was talking about. He actually rode past me on the way to the boat. So yeah. <sighs> what if he turned this way because he saw me or something? And he decided to ride past me. It's like, of course you're gonna go this way. It's like, of course you're gonna go this way. <laughs> it's like, oh, of course you're gonna turn this way. The way I'm fucking going. <laughs> anyway, uh, see, so yeah, I might walk over to the school, you guys. Hopefully, he's not turning that way, because that would be worse. I'd be like, oh, for fuck's sakes. Oh, yeah, he is. Okay. 
Anyway, but hopefully he's not going that way, or hopefully he's not going to the school, because I'll be like, yo, you are freaking being a freaking bad luck charm for me right now. I know you guys are probably confused, like, what are you, who are you talking about? I'm like, but just don't worry about it, guys. Don't worry about it. Actually, the school is kind of right there, or the old school, sorry. <laughs> and actually, if you guys don't know, the field over there, um, the football team, act or rugby team, uh, they actually do games there, or practice there. And one of my cousins actually is in that rugby team, so yeah. And there's actually a way where you can get into the back of that school. But I think you're not, well, I think it's, but I don't think you're allowed, to, I don't think I'm allowed in there though, so I can't go back there and show you guys. But I'm going to show you guys the front of it, so... Yeah, and hopefully he's not there because that would just piss me off a little bit. I'll be like, yo, you're going like the same place as I'm going right now, and it's pissing me off. <laughs> like, do you mind going somewhere else maybe? I'm trying to vlog. <laughs> like, dude, I'm trying to vlog. But he's on his bike, so it's like probably going somewhere else. <laughs> I'm not going to show you guys or tell you guys who he is. Just some random dude. I see him around a lot, and yeah, it's like, well... Yeah, I've seen him around a lot. It's like, well. <laughs> okay, just making sure. This is Murray Street, so this is the street we want to be on. Okay. Can you imagine if he was at the school waiting for me? I'd be like, yo, what are you doing, bro? I'd be like, dog, what are you doing? Like, you're just sitting there waiting for me or something? Like, I was like, what are you waiting for me or something? Like, what's up? Like, what do you want? <laughs> like... Like, what do you want, dude? Like, you're just like, are you like waiting for me? Like, what are you doing? But no, I don't think he's. Or I don't see him anywhere, so I think we're good. Probably went, you know, that way or something. See some squirrels right out there, you guys. Squirrels are out. So yeah, guys, there's the old school. That's the old. Uh, that's actually. I think it was called Victoria Park Public School. Yeah, I think so. I think it was called Victoria Park Public School, like way back in the day. And actually, this also used to be a daycare center. I used to go there one time for a daycare, like, years ago. Like, a long time ago. Like, years ago. Probably, like, 2006 or something like that. 2007, so... Actually, no, I think it was, like, 2006, but, yeah. It was years ago. It was, like, I was, like, little, little. So, yeah. So, yeah, this is what the building I'm talking about. I know there's a sign saying Future Skills High School, but that's I don't think that exists anymore. Yeah. But yeah, this is the place they're uh, they're, they're talking about maybe one day they might want to see if they can put like a homeless shelter here. Like Chatham's first official homeless shelter. But honestly guys, I think that I think it would actually be really cool if they uh, turned it into a homeless shelter. What do you guys think? Do you guys think they should make a, put a homeless shelter? Yeah, or, sorry. Do you guys think they should put a homeless shelter there? Let me know in the comments down below. Because I think it'd be really cool. Well, I don't know if they would keep this playground, but it's if homeless people want to play on the playground, but, yeah. But, I mean, other than that, the building itself could be turned into a homeless shelter. I think that's a good idea. Yeah. It's right by the forest, so it's kind of a good spot, too. Yeah. Now, actually, guys, there kind of is a way you can get in there. Watch. See this? Just stepped over it. Boss. Savage. Just walked over it. Didn't even give a sh Didn't give no fucks. So, yeah. Yeah, they really need... Yeah, they really need to do something with this building. Yeah, because this... Yeah, because this building, guys, has been sitting empty for years. And I, yeah, and I think they should, like, do something with it. And I think a homeless shelter would be a good place, too. If it doesn't become a homeless shelter, though, then maybe they can put, like, a new school in there or something. Like, a new school. Yeah, either, yeah, if this building doesn't work out as a homeless shelter, like, if this doesn't work out as a homeless shelter, then maybe they can turn this back into a school. So, yeah. Either they could turn this into a homeless shelter or a new school, you know? But, you know, some people kind of said there might be some concerns if this was a homeless shelter, but if it does, and but if it doesn't work out, then maybe, maybe they can just try and turn into a new school, right? New elementary school. Yeah. But we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Yeah. This is the entrance to the P-yard. Yep. 
Now guys, this yard is not really even a yard anymore. Even though it still is, like it still it still is the yard. But it's not really like a whole yard anymore. Because back in the day, this yard used to have like lots of tracks, like 10 plus tracks. Now there's only like three or two. So it's like not really a yard anymore. Now actually, if I walk in there, there's a way where you can get over to the Blackbridge Forest. You just gotta walk this way and it'll take you to the woods. Yeah. People come people walk down here all the time. Yeah, people walk down here all the time, so yeah. This yard isn't really busy anymore, so really you can just walk in. And if you want to go, you can just go in there. Yeah. But guys, I'm honestly really glad of how nice it turned out. Like the weather actually turned out to be really nice. Yeah, I'm actually glad the weather actually actually wasn't I might yeah I'm actually glad the weather wasn't really nice today so I guess the weather kind of changed they said it was gonna rain today but nope it's actually nice today so yeah this is the old this is actually the old diamond to CP and CSX just so you got in case you guys didn't notice and if you go that way guys I'll take you to the glue factory you can see there's the smoke sacks of the glue factory over there and that's the Blackbridge Trail. So, yeah. I'm actually gonna see if I can go Colborne Street, which means I gotta cross the tracks. Is this something in my ear? Jeez. Oh, I felt like there was something in my ear. My ear felt itchy. I wonder if there was something in my ear. Oh, that would be not good. Yeah, this is the CP tracks. Cross over. Cross over the tracks. Yeah. I actually wonder if there's any trains coming. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, I think I might end the vlog here, guys. I hope you got... Actually, let's do a thumbnail. There you go. Alright, guys. I might end the vlog here, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, be sure to smash the like button, subscribe, turn the bell on. Sorry, guys. Be sure to subscribe, turn the bell on. And, um... If you guys want to check out the Tecumseh Park vlog from 2020, that link will be in the description down below. If you guys want to check out yesterday's vlog, click right here. And if you want to, if, sorry, if you want to go check out more of my videos, click on my channel icon right here. And be sure to follow my links, my Instagram, my TikTok, my Railfan channel, and my walking channel. I actually have a new video for my walking channel that will be up tonight. I've, I was going to upload it yesterday, but I kind of forgot. So, yeah. But I will upload it today. Don't worry, guys. So, check that video out. I might put that link in the description down below once it's up. So, yeah. Alright, guys. Hope you have a good day. See you guys later.